and we fly from Abu Dhabi back to Singapore on EY473 in business class. The aircraft was not parked at the aerobridge so we had to take a bus. There was a bus for business class passengers which was more luxuriously outfitted with nice leather seats. But it turned out that the ride was a very long and a passenger on board even joked, Are we taking the bus to Singapore? <laughs> yeah, the bus ride was really long. The least had a nice seat to relax so I shouldn't be complaining too much should I? And we arrived and there was only one staircase going up to the aircraft so thankfully there were not many of us. And now boarding EY473. At the previous leg from London to Abu Dhabi we had a couple seat forward facing, couple seat forward facing which was very nice and spacious. This is a Boeing 787-9 which was different from the earlier flight as a Boeing 787-10 Welcome on board at Yard Airways Business Class Business Studio Couple Seat Welcome Dreamers Served yep, and I much. chose water even though there was champagne but I had enough to drink for now there was a rear facing window seat just opposite me to my left as you can see the cabin is a little bit open you can actually see other passengers Passengers were still boarding and we had to wait a bit and indeed this was the Boeing 787-9 as you can see from the safety card. And taking a short walk from the toilet back to my seat, uh, I had to use the toilet on the other side, walk past the cockpit. Plane was still on the ground so cockpit door was open and this is, gives you a view of the business studio cabin. Remember, they are forward-facing and rear-facing seats on this variant on aircraft. The amenity kit which I didn't open and there were four choices of mates. Four. Amazing, right? And for starters, there were three choices of starters. Three and several choices of dessert. Gastronomical treat and here the beverage list. Also a couple of wines to choose from, both red and white. You also have an all-day menu and as the title goes all day, you can have them any time of the day on the flight and they will help you and give you what you want from the all-day menu. That's excellent service on board, isn't it? As I was saying, the seats are a little bit open so I can definitely see the passenger on my left and on my right. 77 EY 470 service from Singapore. We are in the final stage of pre-relation to South Prime Mojo by to Singapore tonight. The flight time will be 7 hours and 15 minutes, 715. Open close for the 7, uh, 370, and uh, final is 390. There has been reports on the area, it's a light turbulence, so anytime you see this, please make sure you'll see what's part of the safety. The weather and travel time in Singapore will keep you just before coming to the stands. Right now, we like to invite the sit back, relax, and enjoy the service. We're coming home. Thank you. in the air and I got some nuts and a drink. Thank you. Okay. Would you like to try it first? No, it's okay. Just, just go ahead. Yeah. Anyway, if you don't like it, just in case, you can let me know. Okay, okay we'll, we'll do. Okay. Enjoy, sir. Thank you. Excellent service. She told me if I didn't like the wine, she would change it for me. Cabin was rather dark because many passengers actually wanted to sleep. I was one of the few that wanted to eat. Oh. Like this passenger, he just didn't want to be disturbed at all. Hi. Thank you. Is this for you and side passes? Yes. Enjoy, sir. Thank you. Thank you. 
YouTube look great and this was actually my first time ordering soup on a flight I think soup looked great and came with bread and garlic bread and I asked for a beer yeah so I was I was very full after the Etihad lounge but still well I'm good flying so I might as well try to eat some more and indeed the soup turned out to be excellent stuff mmm delicious this is my fourth flight from Abu Dhabi to Singapore on Etihad Business and the food continues to impress me, yes indeed. The beer can looks like the one I got my on my earlier flight, I recognize the camel. Yeah, checkmate. <laughs> checkmate. Check. Check C-Z-E-C-H. Checkmate and not check C-H-E-C-K. <laughs> that's funny. I think that's funny. The soup looked a little bit thick, but actually it tasted just fine. I, I, I liked it um, a little bit less thick and it'd be too dilute. Uh, more thick and it'd be too thick if you get what I mean. So, yeah, great job, Etihad. I usually don't take soups as starters, but since this was my fourth and last flight on Etihad, I decided to try a soup. Yes, the bread went so well with the olive oil. Mm. Yep, look at that. Dip, 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 and eat it. I told myself I was quite full, you know, but. I don't know, I kept eating. Thank you. And my main course has arrived. I chose the sambal fish, which comes with some white rice and vegetables. Yes, this is a lighter choice, definitely a lighter choice, and I do like fish. And the sambal, so sambal sauce was not too bad, not hot at all. And that's what the sambal fish dish looks like on Etihad Airways. Overall, it's an easy dish to eat if you like fish and sambal, of course, and I'm glad I chose it. I think I finished it all, but I probably left the rice. Thank you. Thank you. And I had ice cream for dessert. Now, this is quite interesting. This ice cream, as you can see, is actually haagen which they use some sharp knife to stick it out and serve it so beautifully on a white bowl and give you some like a biscuit on top. Yeah, see the effort they put in? Ice cream. Took some few photographs and not bad, huh? my iPhone, uh, not bad. Now check this out. Knock knock, look at how hard it is, yeah. <laughs> Playing a fool with my fork. I'll just give it a little bit of time to defrost and had all the ice cream and even asked for a little bit of whiskey before I went to sleep. I'm sorry it's thank very you. bumpy. Oh, <laughs> just yeah. be careful with the coffee. No okay? problems, thank you. Your milk and sugar are here. Yeah. Did they forget anything? Uh, no. Yes. Okay. Thank you. And just before landing, I asked for some food. I got a steak sandwich, a bowl of fruits, and a bowl of, I think, muesli yogurt and or something like that. I can't remember. And they got some chips, came some chips as well, all served in nice trays. Amazing, isn't it? Plus coffee as well. And that's my breakfast. Yeah, breakfast. Steak sandwich, fruits, uh, muesli. Wow. That's at the heart. That's awesome. Beautiful bowl of fresh fruits, which was really quite refreshing. This was nice to eat too, though I was quite full, so I couldn't finish it all. And this was the legendary steak sandwich, and I've had it a few times now. They've always been good, so I recommend you to try it if you ever fly at the art business. 39,000 foot and is 180 nautical miles northwest of the Singapore Changi International Airport. In about a couple of minutes, you come and start the sands. Join the sand for safety breeze and make sure your seat goes fast. We expect on um, arrive local time uh, 10 minutes to 10 o'clock. It's 9.50 local time. And the weather report is a cloudy sky with temperature 30 degrees Celsius. On behalf of today's other crew, thank you for choosing Edinburgh Airways. And we hope you stay have a lovely rest of the day in Singapore or continue for next destination. Have a good day. Bye-bye. So what a couple seat looks like when the center divider is down. The both of us are really very close to one another. Couple seat forward facing on Etihad Airways. And of course you can bring that up, the center divider, which I did when I was having my meal because I didn't want the light to disturb my partner and wife. Those are my legs and there she is snoozing we're about to land soon yet all right let's go land 
here we are we have landed singapore changi in the morning close to 10 a.m and just a quick review of this flight excellent service and food again as usual a little bit different from previous flights because it was a red eye departing abu dhabi at about 10 p.m in the evening the start of the flight wasn't too great because we had to take a rather long bus ride but after that everything was absolutely smooth cabin service super attentive in fact, many passengers, I think, slept and didn't even eat much. Most woke up a little bit for breakfast, but for me, I just had everything because I was greedy. Oops. Anyway, back to the flight. Yeah, so four flights on Etihad. Check out all my videos. This is the fourth one, and this is the couple seat, which we also flew on when we came from London Heathrow to Abu Dhabi. Ready to disembark and go home. At your heart, Airways has impressed us, and I was told the new cabin is even better. Take care, everybody. Back in Singapore Changi. Welcome. Welcome. Singapore Changi. Welcome home. Immigration hall this morning. Yay, yay.